About three years ago, Rambam Medical Campus decided to introduce a new service which didn't exist before. And a geriatric service was introduced as a very important uh, feature of the hospital. The major uh, activities of the geriatric service, which include specialist geriatricians, specially trained nurses, social workers, uh, in collaboration with physiotherapy and occupational therapy and all the other services that are provided within the hospital, was to provide good geriatric care throughout the hospital, from the emergency room, through the internal medicine wards, surgical wards, intensive care unit, uh, orthopedics, where a high concentration of uh, geriatric patients are treated. Some of these units, up to 80% of the patients are older than 65 years of age. And the service provides both an assessment, geriatric, comprehensive geriatric assessment of the patients, as well as planning, planning for treatment within the hospital and planning for discharge that the patient will return to the community as best as he can and to the most appropriate uh, environment that he can find. My age is 83 and I know that uh, new things and adapting get harder and the unknown is more frightening and I was very that, I think that was the thing that was bothering me. Will I cope? Will I have the right bit of paper? You know? It's a very, very traumatic experience for many of the people. They're put into a bed, they're put into pajamas. Sometimes they get confused what day it is. And the volunteers are trained, number one, to introduce themselves to the patient and perhaps the family who's around them and to have an objective eye and look at the patient and try to identify what the needs are of that specific patient. For instance, maybe the person just wants to talk to somebody. Maybe the person is, um, needs to drink a little bit more. Or they just might want to go for a walk if they are immobile. For this reason, we decided to adopt the HELP program, the Hospital Elder Life program, and have now become the first official center for the HELP program in Israel. It's a story that I, I've told before that a little boy was walking on the beach throwing many starfish into the sea as the beach was covered with starfish and a man came up to him and said why are you doing that there's so many starfish you'll never throw all of them into the sea and he picked up a starfish threw it into the sea and he turned to the man and said to this one i made a difference